you know, I gotta give credit where it's due. The Path of Titans developers are really clever. Because in the same update where they add growth, the mechanic that they know will scare a lot of people away, they also added Allosaurus, and it'll bring those people right back in. Let's see, no stream sniping allowed. Ooh, that, that seems like it might be a problem for me. Uh, no targeting. Well, I did actually just go to target today, so... I don't know about that one. Do not impersonate staff. Well, I am the imposter, and I am pretty sus. Racism, I am extremely racist, so that'll be an issue. Discrimination, I'm ve I am I discriminate against everyone equally, but I think that still counts as discrimination. Self-promo, I'm self-promoting by making this video. No KOS or care bearing. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna have to decline these rules. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, fine, I won't be racist. So welcome one, welcome all, welcome everyone under the sun, because that racism part was a joke. You're all welcome here, no matter your skin pigmentation. So, as you can see, we're back in Path of Titans, and I already said it, the Allosaurus is in. Uh, it's been a while <laughs> since I've played this game, dude. It's been such a long time. Here he is. So, uh, we're back because I saw an opportunity for some content. Allosaurus, you know, everybody knows Allosaurus. Everybody loves Allosaurus. Even when I hate to, I hate to admit it. But I, I do like Allosaurus in a very deep part of my soul. Um, it's mainly the Isle that made me, uh, not care for Allosaurus. The, the Allosaurus fanboys and the Allosaurus players are, are what gets to me. But Allosaurus, I mean... He's, he's, he's a pretty cool dinosaur, I mean, I mean, look at him, he, he's got the Chad arms, he's got the Chad legs, he's got that stupid little smile, you know what I'm saying? I've honestly been missing Path of Titans, like, I've, uh, I've wanted to come back to it for a while now, but I just never really had, like, the opportunity to do so, because, uh, nothing was really ever happening with this game. Whoa, he looks like a chicken or a turkey with that white on him. Yeah, it's been... <laughs> a really long time. And now that growth is added, um, and Allosaurus is here, I figure it's a good excuse to, uh, play yet- ugh, excuse me, play yet again. Now saying that, people have warned me that this growth system is, uh, not exactly the most fun thing in the world, but uh, I guess we'll see once we get in. Oh, that skin is hideous. Okay, I think this skin looks pretty good. It's pretty tame. I mean, you know, it's only the default skin, but hey, what are you gonna do? Okay, as for species, we've got Fragilis, uh, Europus, and Jimadensi. Uh, I don't think I want to do Europus, because, uh, he gets a minus in speed, and that's never a good thing. I think I'm gonna go for Jimadensi, just to get that extra speed boost. And you know what? I'll name you Gort. That's about right. Oh, and he's tiny. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. Time to grow for 12 hours. <laughs> oh, I was really hoping Path the Titans would, you know, stray away from the whole growth thing and be unique. Oh, yeah, and there's a tutorial now. Okay. Uh, move your dinosaur and sprint and jump. Okay. Burn some stam. Is this... Okay. Uh, use the rest key to rest. Okay. So th this is cool that they have this little tutorial thing now, I guess. Um, it it's pretty basic. I'm getting some coins for it, so that's pretty cool. Is there food around here? Oh, there's some food. And there's, an there's another guy here. It's another aloe. Is, is he alive? Uh, he looks pretty... Uh oh, he, he is alive. Hey, pal. What's going on? All right, where's the water? Is this water? It is water. Okay. Let's 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 get some get some hydration in us. I sure do love standing here and watching a meter go up. Oh. Okay. Well, there we go. Okay, wait. So did they change it so you can't like Okay, so 1 2 3 and 4 they're, they're not roar anymore. It's uh what's it called? It's uh use this now, the vocal wheel. This used to be a thing in the aisle. Is this uh That's friendly, right? Okay, that's friendly. Um, broadcast. Yeah, that's broadcast. Threaten. Neat. Oh, hey, look, we got a little Spino here. <laughs> What's he doing? I, I love him. he doesn't have the sail either. He looks really cute. <laughs> little baby Spino. Okay, what do I have to do? Deliver a, a, a Mantia? W what's a Mantia? Oh, okay. Mushrooms. Alright. Do I just go to the blue circle? I think I go to the blue circle. Fetch quests is a dinosaur, because dinosaurs 
definitely care about moving mushrooms to different locations. That makes sense. Alright, bro, let's get high on some shrooms. Yeah, that'll be super fun. Okay, there we go. Uh, unlocking skins. Uh, unlocking skins is a good way to show off your achievements. Um, oh, they're gonna turn this into Primal Carnage, aren't they? <laughs> okay, this abilities thing is new as well. Um, I never actually, like, I haven't played since they added this, and I have no idea how it works, so, like, if y'all in the comments have any tips on how these abilities work, um, please give them to me, because I guarantee you me not understanding how this works will result in my untimely death. Wait, what? I have, I have two skins? I have, I have the backer skin? I, why do I have a backer skin? Did the... Did the devs grant me the backer skins or something? They might have granted them to me, like, a long time ago, I'm not quite sure. And I have the wildfire skin. Um... I actually really like the backer skin. I might go for this. Wow, it actually looks really nice on the aloe. There we go, that's looking pretty snazzy, ain't it? Now let's just take a look at the colors. Yeah, I like pattern three the most. Okay, we'll do, we'll do this. Later. Oh, tutorial finished. Walk through the Mark Tunnel to begin your journey of survival. You may not return to this tutorial area. You will be hunted by other players and therefore must be wary. Glor- Ah, oh, fuck, I- Fucked it up because my tongue doesn't work like a normal person's tongue. All right, um, yeah, I, I guess it's, I guess it's time to head out, boys, in, into the true wilderness. Do you want to take your chances and leave without a group? You know what? Yeah. Who cares? We're, 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 we can fly solo. Well, I guess we're not really flying solo, are we? We are. You know, it's me and you. It's, it's me and the viewer, whoever you may be. I have a timer on quests. Oh god. That's not very fair. So what does that do? Is that like a growth buff? It, or does that mean like I'm getting growth in that time? And then once I once that runs out, do I stop getting growth? Oh actually Clubtail Canyon's not that far. Okay. If I can't make it there in eight minutes, then I'm just a total idiot. By the way, I should probably wish you all a uh, happy late Thanksgiving to my American viewers. Um I wanted to like make a Jurassic World Evolution video that would be out on Thanksgiving, but I was too lazy and I didn't record. It happened again, dude. I, I just get these, like, moments where I just don't have any willpower to record. And especially now that I'm home, because I came back home for the, uh, for, I came back like, home from college for the Thanksgiving break. And, uh, I'm flying back home on Monday. Mon Monday. Mon did I say it right? Monday? Yeah. Okay. Alright. Well, we, we got... We got Clubtail Canyon. Um, okay, Tyrant's Gorge now. Okay, <laughs> we just we just zoom around the map. <laughs> That's what we do now. I don't know. I'm losing a train of thought. You can tell I haven't recorded in like a week, and I haven't recorded the solo commentary video in like probably two weeks now. See, I could make so many more videos if I just stopped being lazy. I want you all to comment, pesky, stop being lazy, you son of a bitch. Or comment something like that, I don't know. Maybe you could do like your own like creative versions of it. Yikes, that's a cliff right there. That's pretty steep. Okay, we can go down this way though, right? Oh god, oh god, oh! That did a little more damage than I was uh, hoping it would. I didn't think that would actually hurt me so much. <laughs> oh well, it's fine. We're, we're healing it pretty quickly. But yeah, I'm sure that's something that you all have noticed. Like when you're trying to do something, whether it's like schoolwork or what have you, it's always distracting to do it. And it's like hard to do it when you're in like a comfortable environment. And that's one thing that sucks with uh, recording sometimes or gathering the will to do it because you know you can do it. But then it's like you think about actually like having to commentate and it's just like, ugh, I could just shut my brain off and play a game quietly and be selfish and be unproductive, you know? And, and it's tempting and it happens a lot more than I'd like to admit. A lot of the time that I could be recording and making videos, I just end up sulking and being depressed while playing Primal Carnage. Not that I'm like actually like literally depressed, Primal Carnage is just depressing. All dinosaur games are depressing, but that's why you're watching this channel, because I try my best anyway to make them not depressing. At least this game seems to have like a bit of a um a pathway now. I didn't get much growth from that at all. So you literally just run around and beat quests the whole time. Is that it? I guess that's it. Alright, Gort, keep your legs moving. If 
throughout the giant empty map that looks the same no matter where you go. And that's a steep hill, but not to worry, because I am a master of going down hills. Thank you, The Isle, for teaching me how uh, to go down hills safely. Oh my god, back in like the early days of The Isle, specifically back when they added, um, bone break for the very first time. People go by him now, like, oh, you slip two feet and you break your leg, haha. -ha. Funny, funny bones snapping, am I right? Lol. No, dude, back when bone break was first added, it was actually insane how easily you could snap your leg. You would just like, you wouldn't even like fall, you could just slide in like a tiny little like jagged spot of the map and it would break your leg. It was actually ludicrous how unfair it was. Server will restart in 40 minutes. Isn't that a shame? Can we climb this? I don't really want to risk it, but actually I think we can. No, I think we're good. Uh, you know what? No, no, no. <laughs> no way. Yeah, I am not doing that. I am not dying because then I have to do that whole stupid tutorial again. I'll just take the longer safe route. And yeah, see, look at that. There's a way up. Patience is a virtue, let me tell you. I haven't really admired our baby aloe all that much, to be honest. Look how adorable he is. Look how stupid his face looks. In a good way, mind you. But... <laughs> uh... Uh, YouTube content. Map still seems as dead as ever, but considering the fact that there's actually stakes to this game now, other than your spawn point, um, I'm not gonna complain too much. I really don't want to run into another player, <laughs> because I'll probably get one shot if they see me. Also, uh, Path of Titans devs, if you happen to be watching this, um, you might want to mess with the cameras on the dinosaurs, because this is as far as I could zoom out on the baby alo, and... It feels really uncomfortable. Like, I'd rather be much further zoomed out. Like, the tail is literally in my face. I mean, I guess it doesn't have to be much further zoomed out, but, you know, d just so I'm not looking at the ground constantly, you know what I mean? We there yet? Oh, we're getting closer. I don't know why this lychee quest isn't expiring. I'm not doing collection quests. I I'd much rather do location quests. So, comment section. I have a question. Um, am I growing right now? Or do I need to have, like, that growth buff thing to actually grow? Because if I'm not growing right now, that seems kind of unfair. Like, I get that they want to not promote AFKing, but I also don't want to play the game. You know what I mean? It's just the nature of dinosaur walking sims. You're not supposed to want to play the game until you hit adulthood. You know what I mean? Yeah, just let me know if I'm actually growing right now or not, because it doesn't look like I am, but, I mean... For all I know, I could be. And we really have no time to waste. Our quest timer is going down concerningly fast. Um, can we make it in time? I'm sure we can. We definitely can. Two very boring minutes later. Alright, we got it. Um, uh, 20 seconds of growth, or 30 seconds of growth, rather. <sighs> is that really it? My god. God. This might be the first time I have a Path of Titans episode that's like a multiple part series because usually it's just like a one and done bang that's it you know but I don't know this one's taking a while why does that lychee quest keep resetting what are lychees anyway like that's the thing I have no idea where all these uh like grabbing items like the mushrooms or the lychees or the acorns or whatever I have no clue where these things spawn on this map and I don't want to traverse this entire thing searching for that, you know? Oh, wait, well, here's acorns. But see, like, they're, they're just in the middle of nowhere. How am I supposed to find that? So let me get this straight. This location quest gives me 50 marks, but collecting 50 thingies gives me only 30. That better give, like, some massive growth boost if I do that, because my god. I don't want to run around <laughs> grabbing fruits and nuts and... I mean, I don't want to grab nuts in general. I feel like I'd be having more fun right now if I had someone in VC with me. But, uh, Z doesn't exactly, uh, subscribe to Path of Titans, if you, uh, if you know what I mean. So, <laughs> that doesn't leave me with many options. Although, I gotta say, though, Z knows what's good for him. He knows not to come near this game with a 10-foot pole. I, on the other hand, have to, because YouTube content, am I right, boys? Oh no, quest failed. I'm 
I'm so sad. How could I ever fail a quest? Oh, I'm so upset. Spino body at CC is not claimable. Okay, cool. I take it Corpse Cove is still popular. Okay, quest done. Another 30 second meager growth boost. And we got another location quest. All right. Let's keep walking. This is the issue with making content for this game. If you're not, like, interesting to listen to, then you're kind of fucked, not gonna lie. Like, people will just click off the video and that's it. <laughs> because who wants to watch a baby dinosaur run around and go sightseeing in an aisle Walmart ripoff? You do, obviously, if you've made it this far into the video. And if you have, congratulations. You know what you've earned? You've earned me requesting you to subscribe. That's what you've earned. Careful going down here. <gasps> oh, Christ. That did too much damage. That was like a tiny drop. That should not be taken out. One third of my health. But welcome to Path of Titans, the best game in the world to ever exist. I do want to take a moment, though, and uh, thank you guys for uh, 30,000 subscribers. It took a while. It did take a hot minute. Partly because I'm lazy, partly because the algorithm seems to have not liked me recently, but we did hit 30k subscribers nonetheless. That's, I mean, it's it's not big for a YouTube channel, I guess, but when you actually think about, like, the numbers, like, the physical numbers, like, 30,000 people watch, watch my videos. I mean, granted, you gotta take inactive su subscribers into account, so it's probably more like, I mean regular, like, dedicated viewers, there's probably only about, like, 10,000, I'd say probably, like, a third, maybe less, are, like, truly dedicated fans. Well, truly, truly dedicated is probably less than that, maybe, like, 5k, I don't know. The point is, if, if you're watching this video, if, if you give a damn about the content, I appreciate you, and I don't really know what I want to do for a 30,000 subscriber special yet. Um... I could just be lazy and do another Q&A. If you guys would like that, I'll do it. Um, I could kill 30,000 hamsters, like I said I might do on Twitter. Uh, follow me there, by the way, at the one true pesky, if you have a Twitter account. I do post some bangers on there, and I piss off Paleo Twitter a lot, so that's always fun. It's, it's always fun to get the Paleo Twitter idiots mad at you. There we go, uh, quest complete. Uh, where's our next location? Redwood Basin. Alright, it's, it seems like the quests are kind of going in a circle. Like, it's not that bad. Like, it's not giving me a quest, and it's like, haha, now you have to go all the way across the map, and then do it again. It's kind of like going in a nice order, so that's pretty good. Um, yeah, Paleo Twitter, idiots. That's, that's all I can really say. Just dumb echo chamber goobers. They were fuming. Absolutely fuming over the design of the Giganotosaurus in Jurassic World Dominion because they released the uh, Jurassic World Dominion prologue. I'm sure most of you saw that, but I think the Giganotosaurus looks really sick. And people were complaining like, oh, it looks too crocodilian. It's supposed to be in the Cretaceous period in real life. So why does it look like it's genetically modified? And my whole thing is if we have a lot of remains of an animal, or we have like a very good idea of what it's supposed to look like. For instance, like something like Triceratops, or T-Rex, or Allosaurus, or Carnotaurus. Dinosaurs that we have like a very solid understanding of. Those ones, I don't think you should like go too crazy with stylizing. You could stylize them a little bit, but don't do anything outlandish with them, you know? But if it's something like Giganotosaurus, because a lot of people don't realize this, but I'm pretty sure our Giganotosaurus fossils are like very fragmentary. Like we have a basic idea of what it looks like, but we don't know like its actual like structure 100%. So I think if we don't have like crazy like fossil record evidence of a dinosaur, then I think it's okay to like stylize it a lot more, you know? Like Metriacanthosaurus, in this game, Metri looks vastly different than the Jurassic World Evolution Metri. I think it's fine to stylize him the way they did in Jurassic World Dominion. I think it looks really cool, personally. Um, I wasn't a fan of it at first, I will admit, but once I actually saw like the prologue in like HD, because they uploaded it to YouTube, because you know, th there was like the, the crappy like screen recordings from when it was shown in theaters that were on YouTube and they all got copyright claimed and taken down. 
But now that it's like actually released to the public officially, you can see that the Dominion Giga looks really cool, and I quite like it. And like I said, Paleo Twitter was just melting down about it because they just can't be happy with anything. If the dinosaur isn't smooth, bland, and unoriginal as hell, they don't like it. Which says something about their personalities. But do keep in mind that this is Twitter we're talking about here, and uh, if you know anything about Twitter, the average IQ of that site is, um, let's just say it is as high as I am years old. I I'm 19. By the way, how did I start talking about Twitter? I just forgot how I started talking about Twitter, dude. Yeah, seriously, how did that happen? All right, Redwood Basin complete. Where to now? Corpse Cove is a baby's dream. Meals galore, little safety for a break. Um, interesting, I guess. Um, you know, maybe we should head there at some point because my food is about half, and I want to stay on top of that. I feel like the scariest thing is right now. The fact that I'm not expecting to see any players. Like, I I'm, I'm totally expecting this video to end without having any player interaction. At least until I get to, like, Corpse Cove. And that's the worst part, because it means I'm letting my guard down. With my luck, there will be some random Serato or Aliaramus or Metri or some crap. Or, who knows, maybe a cannibalistic Allosaurus that'll run up on me and eat my butt. Please tell me I can climb this. Please, please, please. Yes. Okay, thank god. I just took a peek. I've been recording for almost an hour already. I'm still not out of the juvenile phase. Ugh. You know, if this, if this game, and I'm being dead serious, this is not like me, like, being a funny shitter. Me making fun of, haha, dino game's bad. No, I'm being, like, dead serious when I say this. If this game wants to compete with the aisle, and this actually goes for Beast of Bermuda too. I believe I've said this in relation to Beast of Bermuda. But um, they need to just make it so this game is a lot more casual when it comes to grow times. Because a lot of people look at the aisle and see the ludicrous grow times that it takes for dinosaurs. Like, you know, it'll take a five hours to grow a stegosaurus. And then they'll be like, <laughs> no, screw that. I'm not playing this game. But then... If this game takes note of that and says, you know what, we'll make growth be a thing, but we'll make it relatively painless, and, you know, we'll make it quick enough so that you can still live your actual life outside of video games, you know, if, if they did that, this game would have a much bigger player base, and I hope that they understand the fact that not everybody has eight hours a day to grind on a fictional dinosaur. I mean, people have families that they need to attend to, you know? They, they have school, they have work, what what have you. Surprising, I know, yes, dinosaur gamers do have lives outside of the screen. At least, some of us do. A lot of us don't. But, some of us do. I do. Through the magic portal we go? Uh, we didn't even need to do that, because uh, we got the quest. Okay, um, next quest. I'm literally just running around aimlessly. <laughs> they're doing a good job distracting me from the lack of gameplay. Because they're tricking me into thinking that I'm participating in gameplay by running around. Okay, 8 minutes till server restart. Let's see how many quests we can get in that time. Oh my god. Thank you, ominous music, for uh, exaggerating, emphasizing my uh, realization of how far I have to go for this next quest. I could really cut out so much of this footage, but the issue is, if I do, then there really wouldn't be much of a video left, so that's why I'm just kind of, like, continuously talking and not shutting up, you know? Um, is this- oh no. Oh, Christ, Christ, Christ almighty. That was so risky. Why did that kill half my health? I thought I was dead there. I was so sure I was gonna kick the bucket and I would have ended the video right there out of sheer rage. Oh, guys, I, I, ca I can't do this. I, I, I can't do it anymore. It, it's just, it's just not it. Back to Tyrant's Gorge, eh? I missed you too, Tyrant's Gorge. I still don't even know what you are. Because you look the same as everything else on the map. How's our Allosaurus looking? He, he's looking, 
He's looking pretty worn out. Man, I swear, if copyright strikes weren't a thing, I would put on music that I could listen to while I play this game and that you guys could also listen to, you know? It would just be, like, a lot nicer and a lot more chill because, like, I, I, I have such, like, a um, wide variety of, like, music taste. Like, I'll, I'll listen to pretty much anything so long as, like, the lyrics are good and it's not, like, trash pop music by, like, I don't know, who are, who are like, the trashy pop singers, like, J Justin Bieber, um, Cardi B, you know, th those, those goons, you know the ones I'm talking about. Oh my god, this is not a good spot. Okay, maybe I can go down this way, actually. Um, okay, yeah, that's safe. Should be, should be, should be, should be safe, should be safe. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Deathly. Deathly rage. Your code. Your code is ass. Jesus. All right. Um. I think we've gotten ourselves into a pickle here. This precise movement. Precise movement. Precisely land. Okay. We're good. Server will restart in two minutes. Okay. <sighs> You know what? I should probably log. I don't know if it's gonna, like, end my quest or what. If it ends my quest, I'm gonna kill myself, I swear. Three, two, one, zero, log. Okay. There we go. That should be our progress saved. And here he is, Gort. Uh, does it not give us, like, growth statistics? No? Okay. Alright, whatever. Alright, boys. I will be back. I need to take a bathroom break.